Now let's find the common ratio of each geometric sequence and we will show our solution. Although meron na tayong mga upload on how to find common ratio, let's just have more examples para mas lalong maintindihan lalo na sa mga grade 10 students. Always remember, in finding common ratio for each geometric sequence, just take any number divided by the previous number that is equals to ratio. Number 1, 20 divided by 10. Any number, so we will take 20. Previous uh, 20, I 10. 20 divided by 10, and that is equals to 2. 40 divided by the previous number, 20, that is equals to 2. 80 divided by the previous number, 40, that is equals to 2. Therefore, common ratio, pariho sila, kaya, sinas, kaya tinatawag na common, common ratio is 2. Number 2, negative 6 divided by negative 2. Just take any number divided by the previous number. This is positive 3. Next, negative 18 divided by the previous number, negative 6. This is equals to positive 3. Negative divided by negative, that is equals to positive. Next, negative 54 divided by negative 18, that is equals to positive 3. So therefore, our common ratio, pariho sila, our common ratio is 3. Next, number 3. 3 square root of 2 divided by 3, this is equals to square root of 2. Next, 6 divided by 3 square root of 2, that is equals to square root of 2. Ma'am, paano nangyari yan? Isa-isahin natin. 6 divided by 3 square root of 2. First, 6 divided by 3 is equals to 2. So this is 2 over square root of 2. Remember, hindi natin pwedeng ilagay yung radical sign sa denominator. So what we will do is, i-multiply natin itong numerator and denominator by square root of 2. Now, Square root of 2 times square root of 2, that is equals to 2. Ganito yan. Square root of 2 squared. Bali, makancel na yan siya. So, that is equals to 2 na lang. Kaya, 2 na lang dyan. Square root of, of 2 times square root of 2, that is equals to 2. Then, 2 times square root of 2, that is 2 square root of 2. Next, 2 square root of 2 divided by 2, makancel na yan, so that is equals to square root of 2. Kaya square root of 2 na lang dyan. Next, 6 square root of 2 divided by 6, this is obviously equals to square root of 2. So, ang common ratio dito ay square root of 2. Next, negative 6 divided by the previous number, negative 3, that is equals to 2. Negative 12 divided by the previous number, negative 6, that is equals to 2. Negative 24 divided by the previous number, negative 12, that is equals to 2. Common ratio, positive 2. Pariho sila, positive 2. Now, number 5. 32 divided by 64. Previous number. So, this is equals to point 
Next, 16 divided by 32, that is equals to 0 0.5. 8 divided by 16, that is equals to 0 0.5. Common ratio, 0 0.5. Remember, in finding the ratio, Take any number divided by the previous number that is equals to ratio. Kaya tinatawag na common ratio kasi pareho sila lahat. Thank you for watching and all I hope meron kayong natutunan sa video ito. At please see description kasi ilalagay ko rin yung mga na-upload na natin dati with regards sa arithmetic sequence and geometric sequence. I-explain lang natin further itong number 3. Nag-cancel, i-kinacancel lang natin si 3 at si 6 dito ay kinacancel lang. At ito namang nasa gitna natin ay na-explain na natin dito. If you have question, just comment down below.